So today we had a Sight Savers Clinic, which is um, a great day. It's a collaborative effort between Sight Savers America and um, the UAB Center for Low Vision Rehabilitation. You find those letters down there on that gentleman's head? <laughs> Anaya has glaucoma. Glaucoma is a, a devastating eye disease that silently steals sight away, and it's even more devastating when it's happening in a child. And um, was referred to me by both by Dr. Wendy Marsh Tootle at the UAB School of Optometry, who is a pediatric optometrist and has been taking care of Anaya's glasses needs for many years, and by Wade Joyner, who's her glaucoma specialist. Okay. So Dr. Joyner has recently um, done glaucoma surgery to help maintain the sight that she has. So the, the purpose of these clinics are to bring together the Center for Low Vision Rehabilitation and Sight Savers. So Sight Savers has the ability to provide right. recommended Good magnification, job. whether it's video or right. optical, Here's to children who I'm qualify. So we've identified a bunch of children with vision impairment oh, who might need a, a video magnifier or maybe some other type of magnification? Well, a lot of children see the world the way they see the world and they don't often know that they have low vision. And sometimes mom or dad don't know either because they don't know how they see the world. So the uh, vision evaluations are really, really important, especially for younger children because it can cause great problems for them if they're unable to read, function in school. Sometimes it becomes a discipline problem. There's a lot of self-esteem issues that go along with that. What, what are you pointing to? What is that? I've been practicing a long time, longer than I want to say on camera, and before Sight Savers was providing video magnifiers, if I wanted a child to have this in the home, most kids, it's, it's just out of their family's reach. They, they cost between two and three thousand dollars, and that's just too much for your, your typical Alabama family. And now, if if it's too much, it doesn't matter because Sight Savers is there to provide what they need. So no child is being left behind with vision impairment in Alabama. You did a good job on that. Don't you think so? I did, I did, I did. Okay, okay. So let me let me explain some stuff to Mama. 